Hello everyone, welcome to Texas Sports TV and today we're going to talk about once again NHL to Houston, moving an NHL team to Houston. We got some a little bit of news, apparently Houston was never in consideration for an expansion franchise but it's one, but they are 100% interested in making it happen in the future which is pretty great and pretty awesome which is kind of what I've been kind of going on. I still believe the best option for Houston to get an NHL franchise is through relocation and not through expansion. Relocating a team to Houston, a team that's not doing very well, to Houston. Now, we had this year really great. We had two teams in the Stanley Cup that weren't, there, there were Southern teams. We had Tampa Bay from Florida, Tampa Bay, Florida. And then we got uh, the Dallas Stars. One team is even in Texas. And what you also got is one of the players playing for the Tampa Bay team is also a Texas native. So no matter what, Texas wins. Someone in Texas is going to win. It's going to be a Texas native who wins or it's going to be a Texas team that wins. It ended up being a Texan native that won, which is still pretty darn good. And we also got uh, players, not just that, we also got players from the Houston Arrows. Anton, names I uh, can't really. And then we got Gordy Howie, skated for Houston Parts. With the history of the Houston Arrows and the size of the city, it there's, and also, again, once again, natural rivalry, a natural interstate rivalry with the Dallas Stars, well, something similar with Seattle and Vancouver. Houston is often brought up as a future NFL franchise, and it's got to be a future NFL, uh, NHL franchise. It's got to be a, a franchise. Again, a lot of people wanting or thinking that NHL is going to expand beyond 32. Already, I don't think it's going to be this quick. I think the best option, the fastest option is going to be through relocation. And then... He was asked, now the NHL commissioner was asked if Houston was a consideration prior to Seattle being named the 32nd NHL franchise. What he said is not really what we think Houston is and would even be a bigger hockey town. So he knows Houston's going to be a bigger hockey town, which is, he knows this. So he wants hockey in Houston. If you know it's going to be a bigger hockey town with more fans, you want a team there. And we know there's a lot of interest there. We didn't have access to an arena, which I call bull crap on. Because guess what? Uh, we have old NHL arenas that could... Uh, we have the Aeros Arena, which could be retrofitted for the short time being. And we also got the Toyota Center. We got the Toyota Center. That was an NHL arena. That was an NHL arena. Not an NHL arena. It was a hockey arena. It wasn't a hockey arena. And we can... Make a hockey arena. Give us just name Houston a lot earlier. Give us time to build it up. We can have a temporary place until then, even if it's a little bit later. I I just I call bull crap on that one. That would be suitable to put in an expansion team. The combination of needing an owner and somebody who could actually either have an arena or play in an existing arena. That option apparently wasn't available. At some point, we would love to see interest in Houston. In a way that we could make it happen. I know there's a way they can make it happen. Toyota Center. Toyota Center. And here we go. Prior to leaving Iowa for Iowa, the Houston Arrows played at the Toyota Center. And the owner has told the Houston uh, Matters Radio and also many other people. Many people know this. There's not a month that goes by that we don't have some type of talks about the NHL. And it's definitely something that one day I look forward to bringing to Houston, Texas. So, there's got to be a little bit more to it than that. I don't believe this whole bullcrap. Oh, we didn't have an arena to play. Toyota Center, you have an arena to play in. We can build an arena. It's, 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 it's bullcrap. I'm sorry. I call bullcrap on that part. But, yeah. I don't call bullcrap on the fact that Houston would be a bigger NHL town.
in Seattle and would be a really big NHL town with a lot of interest. We have to, to again, Toyota Center. That was an old hockey rink. Uh, it's basketball right now, but you can cover the basketball hockey. It's possible. There's other places that are like that. And that's all. That's all this video. We have the NHL commissioner talking about the possibility and saying that he hopes to bring an NHL franchise to Houston. I still think it's going to be through relocation. But the NHL commissioner himself would like and is, has talked about, which is... That's pretty good. But again, Toyota Center. Don't, don't sit there. There's got to be another reason why it didn't happen. I want to know why the real reason. Because I don't believe this whole, we didn't have a rink to play in. There is. Maybe you couldn't find a suitable owner. Maybe that's it. Maybe you don't think Tillman is a suitable owner. Go with that. That's more, much more believable than we don't have a hockey rink. Toyota Center. Come on.